Henry Junghannel is an Olympic gold medalist, World Shooter of the Year, and four-time All-American. Henry was the leading shooter on UK's 2011 National Champion Rifle Team. During the 2011 National Champion Campaign, he led the team in shooting average for both air rifle and small bore, and earned All-America distinction, an honor he would claim all four years as a Wildcat. He was named World Shooter of the Year for 2013, his senior season at UK. Henry would go on to win the gold medal at the 2016 Summer Olympics in the 50-meter prone event and broke the Olympics finals record with a score of 209.5. He also holds the 50-meter prone world record Good evening, everyone. It's a great honor to be here to this evening um, as the se second inductee from the UK rifle team. Um, both of us had to win an Olympic gold medal, so the standards are quite high for a rifle team member. Um, well. I started shooting at the age of nine. Um, I was at a historic market in my hometown in Germany where, um, yeah, I was shooting at a little shooting booth um, on Apple targets uh, on 15 feet with the crossbow. And I was so excited that my parents had to spend over $50 that weekend uh, on me shooting at this shooting booth. Um, so, next week uh, we went to the shooting club um, and I got hooked up with shooting for the next 20 years of my life. Um, with the, at the age of 15, I made the German national team and the Olympic dream came up in, in, my, yeah, in me. Um, so, after high school, when I yeah, was still pursuing the dream of making the Olympics. Um, I searched for a place to combine academics and athletics as good as possible, which led me to come here to University of Kentucky. And it turns out I had a rough time in the beginning because the first couple of weeks I didn't understand anything. Um, because Kentuckian accent is not what we got taught in, <laughs> in school. Um, nevertheless, I found what I was looking for, like the best infrastructure, the best um, staff. I mean, all of UK athletics is totally excited and totally, um, yeah, it's a great team behind, behind the athletes and it, it was great to come here. Um, so. I must say, Mitch Barnhart oftenly, um, Mitch Barnhart definitely did a good job in leading this um, athletic program. Thanks to that, um, we are as good as we, we are. Um, also, a huge thanks to Vicky and Wendell Bell. Um, I mean, they were with the rifle team at each competition, um, and. I mean, you spent so much time with us. Um, it was always fun. It was always a great honor uh, to have you around. Thanks for that. And most of all, thanks to Harry Marlins. I mean, he's the heart of UK Rifle. Um, he spent 30 years of his life um, to make UK Rifle what it is today. And he's the man with the biggest heart I've ever met. Um, so. I was really grateful to, to help him out to fulfill his dream and make uh, and win the national title in 2011. Um, yeah, back to my Olympic dream, uh, 2011 was also um, a great year for me internationally. Um, I won a gold and a bronze medal at the World Cup season. Um, so I figured I will make the Olympic team in 2012. Turns out I didn't. Um, 
um, I was really devastated, really frustrated uh, when I came came back from the trials uh, for the 2012 Olympics. And well, I think my international career wouldn't have been that successful if it wasn't about UK athletics. I mean, I came back with teammates like Cody Manning, John Sutton, like they were pumped. They were, they were so excited about every minute they were at the range. And uh, I mean, they were the definition of bleeding blue. So there was no chance in being devastated or being frustrated or anything like that. It was, it was just about like going on, train harder, try again, and doing the best what I, what, what I could do. So thanks for getting me back on track. And I think, yeah, 2013 was the most successful year until then. I mean, uh, um, as the introduction has shown, uh, I was nominated, oh, I was awarded with being shooter of the year uh, from the International Federation. And yeah, three years later, I made the Olympic Games, um, the dream I had. Um, and I even came home with a gold medal. So um, thanks to UK Athletics. <laughs> thanks to UK Athletics um, to be there when I needed it the most and to get me back on track, to push me when I needed it. And it's a great honor to be here tonight. Thank you.